untreated heartburn or acid reflux can lead to cancer, which is pretty crazy. If you want a way to force your body to permanently stop acid reflux and heartburn in 48 hours, click the link in the description below. For now, let's get to today's question. How to eliminate acid reflux naturally. So, are you one of the millions of British and Americans that suffer with acid reflux or do you know someone that does? Well there's a huge percentage of sufferers now and that number is increasing every single day. Literally billions are spent on products every year to suppress that acid reflux and the truth is, you don't need to be spending anything at all. How do I know this? Well, today I was prompted to send you this message because I had yet another post in one of my groups about how someone had finally eliminated their acid reflux that they had been experiencing for many years. I get these messages all the time, Justin, it's great to be finally losing weight after having struggled for so long but the big thing for me is the total elimination of the acid reflux I've been experiencing. Now, I love these posts, it's what makes me literally spring out of bed in total excitement knowing that I'm living my purpose and fulfilling my personal question of how may I serve today. So, why is it that so many people experience this horrible and downright annoying condition? You have to first understand the root cause of the issue. You see, it's not the fact that you're making too much acid and I understand why you would think like that. You make too much so you burp it up right? Well. It's actually the opposite of that. The acid reflux is your body's inability to produce as much HCL or hydrochloric acid in your stomach as it needs to digest the food and maintain balance or homeostasis of your gut. This can be caused by many things including poor food choices over time and also, stress. Many times acid reflux is a sign of H. pylori, which is a type of bacteria. These germs can live in your digestive tract and after many years can cause sores called ulcers, in the lining of your stomach or the upper part of your small intestine. Okay, so with that very basic knowledge, I'm going to show you some easy and natural ways that you can start today to begin to make you feel better and save you the embarrassment and help you avoid having to take that medication with you everywhere you go. Right, here we go. The first tip has to do with why so many people are seeing an increase in acid reflux and why it just won't go away and also the reason why so many of the people who work with me on my 28 day body challenge and also in my other programs see a complete elimination of acid reflux and that is stop eating processed foods foods that came from mother nature not food like products not foods that could sit on the shelf for years and not go off start eating whole foods foods that have everything already in there to help you digest it believe it or not mother nature put specific enzymes in that specific whole food to be able to digest it properly eat food like products and your body's gotta find some enzymes to break that food down it has pieces missing if your budget allows have as much organic foods as you can too next up while you're trying to repair your gut you'll want some probiotics and by that I don't mean these things like Yakut, Actimel or Activia, as they come with a heavy dose of sugar, dextrose skim milk powder their ultra heat treated many are homogenized contain artificial sweeteners live in plastic bottles plus contain flavorings. So, since your gut environment changes every 20 minutes or so, 80% of your immune system resides in your gut, 90% of the serotonin which is the happy chemicals produced in the gut. I recommend that you have a good quality probiotic and prebiotic with as many different strains of bacteria as possible, you are what your bacteria eats. Next, you'll want to switch up the type of salt that you have, from normal table salt that simple enhances the flavor of your food to a salt that actually provides you with minerals. The types of salt I'm talking about are Himalayan salt which is pink in color or Celtic sea salt. These salts can provide over 88 trace minerals. It's one of the special fat flush ingredients that everyone on my 28 day body challenge starts the day with. Next. There are many food triggers to acid reflux. If you're a sufferer then you will know exactly what I'm talking about. These can be sugar, dairy, wheat, alcohol, caffeine. These are all really common. If you do a small detox of a few days then you'll eliminate a lot of these anyway and it will start you on the road to better habits and reducing these common culprits and also show you just how great you can feel. I always incorporate a small detox into my programs for that very reason. Next is apple cider vinegar. Now, not just any old cider vinegar, just like with the cider not all similar things are created equal so you'll want to find yourself a specific brand and that is Bragg's it's organic it's raw unfiltered unheated unpasteurized 5% acidity and contains the amazing mother of vinegar which occurs naturally as strand like enzymes of connected protein molecules you'll want to take between 1 and 2 tablespoons mixed up in some water about 10 minutes before your meals dot and finally something I always have my 28 day challenge groups do is smoothies but 
If you have a juicer, you try this gut healing recipe out using that too. So, here we go. You'll want some cucumber celery, some greens, a green apple, one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. And all you simply do is blend or juice all of that and it's a great way to start your day on the right note. If you find it difficult to drink at first because you're just not used to them then your get out of jail free card is to add the juice of one lemon. And boom, you're done. This article first appeared here. I'm just in Lord creator of the brand TBT and what I want most is to improve people's lives and well-being. Thank you so much for reading. Mind if you do me a sweet favor? Tap the button if you enjoyed this article. It'd mean the world to me. Thanks again for spending part of your day here. Hope to see you come back. Smile.